This is the tale of Bilbo Baggins, a hobby. In a hole in the ground, there lived a hobbit. Bilbo Baggins was a respected hobbit. He lived a comfortable life and never had any adventures. So Bilbo was rather surprised when Gandalf the wizard invited him on a great adventure. He politely declined. But not before accidentally inviting Gandalf to tea. The next day, Gandalf arrived with 13 hungry dwarves. They ate everything Bilbo had to offer, then sang sad songs and listened to their king, Thorin Oakenshield. At dawn, we begin the quest of Lonely Mountain. We will win back our ancient kingdom under the mountain, reclaim our treasure, and have revenge. On the cursed dragon smile. King Thorin, you need a burglar to steal into Lonely Mountain. Here he is, Bilbo Baggins. Huh? Oh. Excitable little fellow, but fierce as a dragon in a pinch. into this, you'll have to dream your way out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Get them, you filthy rat bags! Tear them apart! It was just a dream. Just a dream. But what an adventure! Despite his fear, something awoke within Bilbo. He wanted to visit distant lands, explore caves, and carry a sword instead of a walking stick. To his own astonishment, Bilbo agreed to go. You've slept half the morning, Mr. Baggins. That won't convince Thorin that you're a fierce burglar. Hmm. I'll show him if I have to walk to the east of east and fight the wild wereworms in the last desert. For well, now, you'll just have to walk to the Green Dragon Inn. The dwarves are waiting. But get No time for it, and no time to pack. Just fetch your walking stick. Who knows where you will end up today? <laughs> No time for that. I need to go meet the dwarves at the Green Dragon Inn. Meet the dwarves at the Green Dragon Inn. Off you go, Mr. Baggins. Bungo and Belladonna Baggins. A hobbit couldn't ask for finer parrots. Hmm, what's this? My pocket has sprouted a hole. Oh. My silver pennies must be scattered all over Hobbiton. I was thinking about Bull Roarer Toot. You know all about Bull Roarer Toot, don't you? Of course. He's my great, great, great. He was quite an adventurous Hobbit. Won the Battle of the Greenfields, he did. Knocked the Goblin King's head clean off with a wooden club sailed through the air and went right down a rabbit hole. Well, that's where we got the game of golf. Mm-hmm. So I've heard. Ah, Bull Roarer Took. I wish you young people knew more of your histories. Beautiful day, isn't it? Good day, Gamma. I seem to have lost my quilting needle somewhere in town. If you find it, could you please bring it to me? Certainly, Gamma. Oh, I'm hungry. 
It's almost noon, and I've only had two breakfasts. There's a lovely seed cake cooling in my windowsill. I think I'll head home for a morsel before lunch. Bilbo Baggins, I saw your visitor. Are you meddling with wizards? Wizards are meddling with me. Another lad going off into the blue for mad adventures. You might as well be some use before you go. Fetch my butter churn, please. Where is it? It's in the shed round the corner. Just place the butter churn on the porch when you find it. Bilbo. Have some berry crumble tea cakes. I made them fresh this morning. Oh, and Bilbo, watch out for that wizard. We'll need a lot of food on our journey. I saw a dwarf wandering around town. Did you see him? He had a beard so long he tucked it into his belt. And he was dressed so outlandishly. He must have gotten lost on his way to Bree. Apples in all Hobbiton are in that apple orchard. I'd get some if I could climb those cliffs.
wizard is responsible for so many lads and lasses going off into the blue for mad adventures. Why anyone would set foot outside the Shire is beyond me. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? Well, the best apples in all Hobbiton are in that apple orchard. I'd get some if I could claim those cliffs. Hey, Bilbo! Wanna play some hide-and-seek? I'm afraid I'm in a bit of a hurry. We'll go hide. You seek! Ready? Go! Children. The bridge is out. But I need to get to the other side. I could fix it, but I'll need my hammer and nails. Fetch me hammer. I saw Carl playing with it up by the waterfall. There are some jars in the mill. You'll have to break them open to get the nails. Bring back me hammer and nails and I'll fix the bridge.
My children insist I tell them all about dragons. Where do they ever hear of such creatures? Respectable hobbits don't discuss such things. 